Welcome boys and girls and mums and dads. What are we going to do today? Oh, I see the green lights on. We do not want the red light to go on. So let's go, go, go. Our topic is electrical safety. Today we are going to learn a few facts about electricity, learn some electrical safety rules at home, Discover safety rules out and about. Activity 1. Electricity. Electricity is an important part of everyday life. Look around the room and see how many things you can find that needs electricity. Here's a clue. These things will have a wire and plug. Although we use electricity every day, it can be dangerous and we must follow rules to keep ourselves safe. The dangers of electricity. Electricity is energy that can flow from place to place. This is called a current. This flow of energy is what powers all kinds of things like computers, lights and televisions. If electrical items are damaged, fires can start. Not being careful around electricity can cause an electric shock. An electric shock is when an electric current enters the body. This can make it hard for the person to breathe, it can burn their skin, and in the worst case, a person can die from an electric shock. How can we be safe around electricity? There are lots of ways to stay safe around electricity when you are at home. Don't touch plug sockets. Ask an adult to plug something in for you. Putting your fingers or another object in a plug socket, even if it is switched off, can give you an electric shock. Adults must not plug too many things into one socket as this can cause a fire. If you notice an electrical wire is damaged, do not touch it and tell a grown-up straight away. Don't touch a light switch with wet hands as it can give you an electric shock. This is why most bathroom lights have pull cords. If a piece of bread gets stuck in the toaster, Adults must not use knives to try and get the bread out. A knife is metal. Electricity can travel through the metal and give the person holding it an electric shock. What could the adult do instead? The adult would need to unplug the toaster before getting the bread out. That's right. Activity 3. Electrical safety out and about. These pylons have thick cables which carry electrical current along distances. You should never go near a pylon. This is a pylon. If adults are using electrical equipment outdoors, it must be weatherproof which means it is made to keep the rain out. Watch Dad next time and Mom and be careful when you come across those big power lines. If you see this sign or these signs, keep away. It means there is dangerous electrical equipment nearby. Please tell your Brothers and sisters and all your family members, that means danger. Now you know most of the safety rules about electricity. Be the safety inspector and walk around your home, checking all electrical cords and plugs. You've done well this lesson. Well done boys and girls. See you next time.